Hello everyone, this video is to show you how to add acid directly to the pool. Normally we add acid in that bucket uh, for a gallon of uh, water ratio. Um, we're not doing that here. This is when the pH is too high causing chlorine not to be made. We take our acid bucket here, handy dandy. You'll notice that there are cup markings, one through four on the handle. That will need redone at some point, but I'll take care of that. And we have our acid, which is stored in these containers here in room three. Now, before we go add it to the deep end of the pool, we have to come over here. What you will do is you will take, you will turn this off, turn that off, turn that off. Then you will go over here and you will turn this one off and this one off. That will isolate the chlorine system, the chlorine and acid system. Do not touch anything coming from this line. This is all mechanical and bad that we don't want anybody else to touch. If you need to add acid to the pool, you must first shut off these three red levers and the two levers feeding and letting the water out of that system. Then what you will do is you will take this gallon and this all the way to the pool by themselves separately. Do not pour it down here and walk all the way to the pool. That will be bad. What you need to do is once you get there, uh, based off the chart that will be in the wiki, you will know how much, how many cups of acid to pour from this into that. Do this at the deep end of the pool. And then once you have this poured away, pour it into here, however much you need, and do this at arm's reach and away from your face. You want to dump this slowly and spread it out as you go, just like that. Uh, I will take another video of me doing it at some point. Uh, and then you will rinse out this in pool water, just swish it back and forth so all the acid comes out of there, and then you'll bring it back. Then you will wait about one hour before you turn those feeders back on, and that should lower your pH to what's desired for it to produce chlorine. Now, how you know it's producing chlorine? There will be bubbles in this. Um, so, when that pH is low enough, you turn that back on, that back on, that back on, that back on, and that back on. And what should happen is that should start producing chlorine again uh, once the pH has dropped. So thank you for this uh, watching this video. But that is how you add acid directly to the pool. Different than adding acid to this. And I will uh, have another video of me actually doing it so you can see the demonstration in work.